Hi guys, welcome back to the Home and Homestead. My name is Rebecca, and today you'll be joining me while I go over some items that are really helpful for gardening. In particular, these garden helpers are great when you're starting your own starter plants from seed. So if you've ever done this process before and your plants are just not quite what you would have liked them to be, or if you have a bunch of seeds and they become unorganized or that you lose some seeds, these couple of items I go over with you may be helpful for you. So follow along while we go over these garden helpers. So first that we have here is a nice size heat mat. So if you've ever started plants from seed and you find that they're just not doing really well, you may have tried the heat fan and that works a little bit to keep the plants warm, you might want to add a heat mat beneath your trays for planting. And what this does is provides a nice warm environment for the seeds in the pots that they're growing in so that it warms the soil and it helps the germination of your plants. This particular heat mat is a nice size, it's 48 inch by 20 and 3 quarter inch and it fits really well underneath the grow light that I have. So it's a nice option for me in particular. And then this also comes with a the thermostat, which is digital. You just plug it in and you set the temperature you'd like. It comes with a manual to help you through that process. There are a number of heat mats on the market. Some are rather expensive. And this one I find to be in a nice price range. And this might be a nice option for you if you're starting to make your own starter plants from seed and you wanted to try out a heat mat to see if it works well for you. Okay, so to speak a little further on this heat mat, when it first arrives, it comes in a small box like this. And it's all rolled up kind of tight. So what I did was I, I laid it flat on the surface and I put some cookbooks down and that helped this heat mat to lay flat. As you can see, it's not an issue and it, it will eventually lay flat and be fine underneath your growing trays. So let me show you another item that I find helpful when doing my starter plants. Now also if you're starting plant starter plants from seed, you know that you end up with a lot of seed packets. And you don't use up all the seeds some years. You have those extras and you want to save them and organize them. It works really well for that would be a little container to help you with that process. So this is a plastic container. And inside of here it has 16 smaller containers where the seed envelopes fit really nicely in here from the various manufacturers. It also comes with these little labels, but I prefer to use my label maker and then I just put a little label on each of these for the various other fruit, vegetable, herb, flower, whatever. So then you know exactly what's inside of each of these little cells inside of this container. And it has a handle so you can quickly take it where you need to go and it stores nicely upright or on, the, on its side when you're planning what you're going to plant for the year. So this is a really nice way to organize your seeds and it helps keep them all in one place so you know exactly where they are. Well, both of these items, both the heat mat, which comes with the thermostat set, and the seed organizer and storage container, the individual cells, work really well for this process. So if you're considering doing the starter plant process from seed, you might want to check these out. Or if you're already making your own starter plants from seed, these might be handy for you as well. I hope you're having a great day and you enjoyed this quick video on a couple of items that, that I find helpful when starting plants from seed. If you're new to the channel or haven't done so yet, I would really appreciate you subscribing. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. See you next time. Take care.